people depict us the way we grow up is how we're going to be in life. And no, that's not true because we're creative minds. We know what we want to do. We're trying to get there. We don't know how to express ourselves. We just know how to lash out. We'll hold in so much until we just lash out and do something we can't take back. I really just wanted to be an artist, but I told my teacher that. She was like, artists don't make any money. And I was like, well, I guess I won't do art anymore. Embrace the Mess is a professional development workshop that breaks down the fears and boundaries that prohibit vulnerability and creativity between educators and teenagers. We start each program by establishing a set of team norms that we require each student to embody. And as teaching artists, we hold ourselves to the same standards. Be authentic. I thought when people ask me questions, they want to hear what they want to hear and not what's coming from my heart. It just taught me to be real. I wasn't all that cool with like letting people in. I eventually learned like being vulnerable and to let that out. It made people understand and not not necessarily like pity you, but they feel for you because they know like, okay, you've been through a lot and you still standing. It's a no judgment zone here. Everybody gonna always tell you it's okay. You know, if you did wrong, they gonna tell you what you did wrong, but it's gonna be followed by so much positivity on how to fix it. We then provide a set of tools that teach the students how to be introspective and tell stories in a structured format. We participate in the exercises together, so becoming a student ourselves makes us vulnerable as well. And when the students see this, we appear to them as someone who's in the mess with them. We've created a tribe with a culture of collaboration between students who need access and teaching artists who are working in the industry and want to pass down their knowledge and experience. We train together, we eat together, and by the end of the program, we have a new set of students that truly believe they can have a career in the industry. I'm a writer, and I wasn't really confident with my writing, but like, how does make me feel like I can really write and that I could really succeed with this? Cause like, I didn't feel like I could do it, but I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I met different artists. They're doing what they love and making money. So that changed my perspective a lot. I want to be like successful with my writing. Like when I walk into a place, people be like, oh, that's Janae, or whatever my writing name will be. I know I'm good at art. This is what makes me me. Even if I wanted to stop, I couldn't stop. Being here in this group showed me that I have family here. I know I can call anybody in there when I'm going through something. They're gonna make me realize that I have a purpose. We are stars, we are candy bags, we are all of the above. We will surprise y'all. We want you to be a part of the tribe. Listen to the podcast and find out how you can bring Embrace the Mess to your students.